happy birthday. How are you guys? Thank you so much for being here with me today. I hope that you're all doing well. I wish you all a happy birthday. I'm so happy that it is your month, your season actually. So just know that I send you all so much love and light. And if you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Lynn and this is Passion of Heart Tarot. I'm back with another weekly love reading for you guys. And this energy is gonna go from the 13th of December through the 20th. And if you haven't already subscribed, please do give this video a thumbs up, comment, share. And if you would like to book a personal reading with me, that can be done on my website, passionateheartarot.com. And you can also follow me on Instagram at passionateheartarot. So let's see what's coming in for the week ahead, okay? But before I begin, I just want to take a moment to invite the white light. We have this Libra energy that's here. Something is definitely coming to an end. A cycle is closing and someone is absolutely sure about that, that they want to make that decision. Sorry, you guys, I'm just checking for a guy. He's right down there. My little puppy that I just got. So anyways, if he bumps the camera, I'm so sorry. So, but what I can see here is that there's a cycle that's coming to an end because it's been rather hard for someone. I see this energy of just being so drained. It's so burdensome, emotionally so draining because someone is really overthinking, overthinking the conversations that have occurred and even just really, they're being so hard on themselves about things that they wish they said differently, things that this person said to them. Someone here, it could be your energy, Sagittarius, or it could be your person, but they are in a very stressful place. But it's beautiful that that energy is coming to an end because it is just too much to keep on dealing with. You know, what I can see here is like, someone who has so much stress on their plate and emotionally it's just something that they cannot deal with anymore their heart is their heart is telling them that that it's something that they can't continue to do so a cycle is closing in a major way and it is like something that is final Someone made a final decision here. They did. And for others of you, it's it's something that needed to come to an end because it has come full circle. All right, I wanna see why. Why is this Nine of Swords here coming through? So you could be feeling this way, Sagittarius, or someone could be really stressed out thinking of you because they're really losing sleep and it's affecting how they feel about themselves, how they feel just on a day-to-day -day basis. This person has no energy. My goodness, Sagittarius, I wonder what's going on with you guys because there's something here that has to do with the lack of trust in a major way. Someone may feel like they've had another person come into their relationship and divide divide them. Something has come between you guys. And, and it's like someone doesn't want to see the truth about what that is. So that could be you, Sagittarius, like not wanting to accept that this person's energy is not trustworthy and it's someone who they they'll do what they want and they'll think about the consequences later and that's only if they're caught for doing what they do they're very deceptive very manipulative and this person is going to break the other one's heart I see here where there's there's a lot of anxiety that someone is, I'm sorry to see who whoever is going through this kind of stress because it's really, a lot of it has to do with what someone 
said to them and they keep thinking about it over and over and over they're really tortured by it but they and they don't want to see the truth they don't want to but i can see here where the energy is moving in for this cycle of heartache and pain to come to an end i see that that i definitely see that i'm going to look further into this ten of wands There, there is someone in this connection. Leo's energy is here as well as Libra. So you guys may be dealing with a Leo or a Libra, or you could have that in your chart. But there's someone here who is upset about the way that the, at the pace, the pace of things. They wanted they wanted this person to be more serious about them much faster than someone was either ready to or prepared to but there's so much holding back here of the truth of of really someone really has not expressed they haven't really expressed themselves or how they feel and i don't see them be becoming very expressive about it but there is a huge disappointment when when this cycle ends don't think that the that the mm, some i see the both of you being upset even even though this other person's energy someone in this connection there someone at least feels like they can't be trusted they feel like something's coming between them even another person is coming between them this is what someone feels but what I do see is, is both of you being upset about this and really not wanting it to come to an end, but it's something that has to. I want to look and see what a world card is here. Let's see what this is here. And when that cycle ends, this Virgo energy is here, so someone's going to go into a place of quiet reflection where they do a lot of soul searching and a lot of thinking and they really isolate themselves this person's kind of like hibernating now they are and it's so they can heal this is a healing energy that comes in so one cycle ends and then it's time for someone to get some rest and relaxation but moreover, it's about the reflection that's going to be done because if you have someone's energy here. It could be your Sagittarius who, once this cycle ends, you just want time alone. You do, somebody here does because it's been so much dealing, so many problems that I can see. Too much for someone to bear emotionally. So it is kind of like a relief when this energy comes through with the cycle closing and just being able to be alone and stop and really think things through. But you will have someone who's like tugging at the other one, trying to trying to keep the connection intact. That's what I can see. Maybe even promising them that things are going to be, you know, things are going to move along faster. But this is a, a decision that is, it feels very final to someone even if it feels final and your energy is here as well so you may be dealing with another Sagittarius but what I can see is like someone feeling at the time or at least telling their person that they're done but they're still holding on to like this they're kind of doing it to test this person and see how do they feel if if i tell them that we're really done that we're really over it's kind of like a test because you still have someone here who's holding on they're just slowing things down in their mind you know but their heart is still their heart is still open so i mean but that's natural it's not like you can just get over 
all of this stress and because there's good times but there's bad times and it looks here that the good times didn't carry enough weight it became something that was very stressful but a lot of reflection is coming in and something that hurt you or some or someone is hurt it could be your person Sagittarius but they're if it's your person they are going to really isolate themselves and not talk this this is someone who feels like they need to be alone for their own good for their own well-being let's look into this Libra energy that's here Yeah, it's, it's something is definitely, there's so much disappointment and someone's going to decide that it, they don't want to be disappointed anymore. They don't want to hold on to these ideas because it's, it's almost like the deception was in the way this person presented themselves and the way that they thought it was going to be because someone thought that this was going to be like a fairy tale and they are starting to realize that it's, it's not worth it, that it's causing more stress than anything. So for some of you Sagittarius, for the week ahead, I see cycles closing, but it, it feels like it's a relief because you know that you won't have to, because this is something that it really needs to be set down. It's too heavy for someone to carry around. So when they decide that they are gonna set it down and walk away from it, ultimately it does feel like a relief. All right, Sagittarius. So I know that for some of you that might seem a little bit scary, but it, it it's something that someone feels they need to do because maybe Someone in the connection doesn't realize just how much stress this person is going through. Just how much they have on their plate and how much, you know, how they don't sleep at night and they're just overthinking, thinking about everything. So if this is your person's energy, Sagittarius, and you care for them, it might be a good idea to try to help ease their mind and to be a little more understanding because this is like a person who's on the brink of like truly walking away because it's too much for them to take they're going through so much and this is someone who really needs to be supported so if this is your person's energy you can make the choice as to whether or not you you want to try to help them along or maybe it's something that you're tired of dealing with as well because you know maybe this person is one who really gets wrapped in up in their own head and misinterprets everything and just there's a lot of nonsense a lot of arguments so you may be the one Sagittarius that is like you know what fine we can close this cycle and we can walk away either way there's there's a period that comes in of just needing to be alone so that energy could be on both ends it's like a it's like a a breather a pause that someone really needs to take here all right Sagittarius so just know that I love you guys and I do wish you all a beautiful birthday season if you haven't already subscribed please do give this video a thumbs up comment and share and I will see you guys next week I love you all so much